In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the unboxing and complete setup of your Canon Pixima TS3720 all-in-one printer. You can also follow it for Canon Pixima TS3722 printer. Both are of same series, so setup process and everything is same. First, we'll take the printer out of this box. From the printer, you will get some booklets for the setup. Setup in cartridges, black in color, power cable, and also take the printer out. So just slide it out. Remove this packaging. Plug in the power cable at the back of the printer. So that is here. Switch on the printer. This printer comes with the setup in cartridges. So take them out of the plastic packaging remove this orange seal take the second ink cartridge remove the orange seal at the front of the printer we have to open this section so press it down we have to install the ink cartridges here press this lock down Place color on the color side, just place it here, it will adjust it in its position and then you can just lift it. Then black and adjust it and lift it. Now close this panel, go to the printer display panel. It has started to recognize the ink cartridges. It will make some noise in the starting. Next step is to load the paper. Adjust the size. load paper once you load the paper press ok to confirm now the printer is ready for the copy and for the printing and scanning we have to do the wireless setting for that we have to do the Wi-Fi setup of the printer to do the wireless setup we have to use a smartphone or laptop or MacBook right now I'm just going to use my iPhone download the Canon print app you can download it from the app store click on the add switch select the option register printer and here we have to click on the if printer cannot be found it will ask you if your printer is listed below no on the next screen you can select auto connection that is the recommended option it will ask you if your printer has a button like this yes we have we have to press and hold this button for three seconds on the printer display panel so the button is here press and hold it for three seconds one two three and release it printer power light will start to flash go to your smartphone Confirm and click next. Press OK. Now your printer your printer will ask to join a network. Click on the join. Make sure your smartphone is already connected to your wireless network if you have home Wi-Fi network then it will display the network and you just have to click yes if you don't have wireless network even then it will give you the direct option and automatically it will connect with the printer printer is almost installed close this window and close this window you will see Canon TS3700 series that's the 
series of the printer so it will display like this and now we can start using it for wireless printing and scanning even on the printer display panel we can see the wireless signal is showing up with zero let's do copy print and scan with this printer for the copy we can simply lift this panel place the page you want to copy like this select black or color copy and it will give you the print paper output tray is here So printer has just printed for the first time and it sometimes take longer when we have to do it first. Next step is to do the scanning. For wireless scanning we have to go to your smartphone and in the Canon print app you will see there is a scan option. Click here. Also place a page for the scanning facing down. Go to the change setting options and we have to select if it's a document yes color and original is the letter size so we can go back click on the scan icon and press ok Scan is done. If you want to add more pages, you can just add the next page and click on the scan. Like this, you can add number of pages. Once you are finished, click exit. On the next screen, it will display all the pages they, that are scanned. Then click on this share icon. Use as PDF. If you want, you can use it as a JPEG. On the next screen, scroll up and you can click on the save to files you can also give a name to your file and then click on the save icon this way we can do the scanning with this printer for printing we can go back to the main screen select any photo and give a print command or you can go through the photo print and it will give you the option to use the smartphone or if you want to print a document just go to the document section click on the documents all the documents you have in your smartphone will appear here and we can start printing from here for example this is the test print page click next click no click print so let's see the printing speed printing is done and I can say the print quality is really good of this printer once you have finished it you will see the confirmation message press ok and close this window or you can go to the back so that's the way we can do the complete setup of the printer and then we can start using it for wireless printing and scanning thanks for watching